Good morning, Great Breath Bobcats. I'm Bob. And I'm Kat. Today is Friday, March 8th, 2024. And now, please rise to the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for some announcements. Today's lunch is choice A, pizza, and choice B, sun butter and jelly. Remember, there is roller skating Saturday night at GBS from 6 to 9. Admission is $8, and the theme is punk rock. Attention 8th graders interested in playing football at Convalp. This Sunday, March 10th, from 4 to 6 p.m., there will be a workout at the high school for 8th graders only. Come and show your interest. Go Cougars! Did you know your teachers have talents other than educating you about the subject they're passionate about? Be on the lookout in the main hallway for amazing art made by your teachers. It is the very first, very first GBS teacher art show. Playcast, please check in with your Block G teacher today and see what you missed yesterday. Good morning students. Today is game day. Mr. Kogan is challenging anyone who is up to it in a Just Dance song. Miss Young will challenge anyone in an opera song, and Miss Anderson is willing to take any on anyone in a board game. Hope to see you at the, today's game day event. And do you think you have what it takes to meet Mr. Kogan, Miss Young, and Miss Anderson? At HDI, we'll have class next Wednesday because we don't have school Tuesday. And now for weather. This is weather with Bob. Today's high is going to be 49 degrees and the low is going to be 28 degrees. And it's going to be sunny all day. There will be no chance of precipitation today. And it's going to be really nice out at recess, Bobcats. So make sure you take in the warm weather. Here's a joke. What do you call raining monkeys? April showers. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's all for weather. And now for I Am Root. Bobcats and welcome back to Root with Bob. This week's Root is tele, which means distance or to transmit something over a great distance. And at today's Root word is television, the world's greatest form of passive entertainment. So for those of you who go outside, a television can show you pictures of things far away or not even real with sound and motion. The television, or TV, was created by Philo Farnsworth in San Francisco. It took him a whopping 27 years, but in 1927, the first demonstration was held. Though such greatness could not be kept a secret, and soon other countries caught on. Now TV is worldwide. Oh, uh, oh no, I'm missing my shows. Uh, tech guy, you know what to do. <laughs> 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 Welcome back to Jokes with Bobby. This week's jokes are clothing themed. Why did the golfer have an extra pair of pants? In case he got a pull in one. <laughs> <laughs> What's the biggest problem with snow boots? They melt. <laughs> <laughs> How do you warm a room while you, you're painting? Give it a second coat. <laughs> <laughs> That's all for jokes and whenever the joke, laugh. And now for time trivia.
Hello, Bobcats, and welcome back to Time Trivia with your host, Kat. And Kat. Well, Kat, why don't you tell us the theme for today? Good idea. Today, we are doing music trivia. All right, sounds fun. But are we focusing on a specific type or genre of music? Well, we are just kind of broadly covering music, but we will clarify if needed for specific questions. Alrighty then, what's the first question? Before Wrecking Ball was so famously sung by Miley Cyrus, who was it originally offered to? Was it A, Beyonce, B, Lizzo, C, Shakira, or D, Camila Cabello? Well, Kat, I don't quite know the answer, so I'm going to guess D, Camilla Cabello, because she has turned down songs that have became fame big hits before. Well, Kat, that is a good guess and a good answer behind the reason, but the answer is A, Beyonce. Wow, I never would have thought that Beyonce was offered Wrecking Ball. Me neither, Kat. The next question relates to country music. Which of the following country artists were born in 1983? Was it A, Elvis Presley, B, Carrie Underwood, C. Garth Brooks or D. Johnny Cash Wildcat, I don't personally listen to country music that much, so my guess is A. Elvis Presley well, Kat, the answer is actually B, Carrie Underwood. That makes more sense now that I think about it. Well, Bobcats, this has been Time Trivia with your host, Kat. And Kat. And remember, Bobcats, you've got time. And, and now, back, back to the anchors. And now for birthdays. Happy Bobcat birthday! We hope it will be great! Every single Bobcat, get up and celebrate! Yay. Happy! Happy birthday over the weekend to Shane B. and Elizabeth P. We're glad you were born. Respect, responsibility, and safety. It's the Bobcat way. You with the great great Brooke. So have a great, great day. day. Thanks for watching. watching. Bye. Bye.